Oh, Doctor, it's another fantasy fight here on the Laser Time YouTube channel. Uh, what is happening today? Oh, oh my yeah. God. So, uh, yeah, this week is Metroid's 30th anniversary. Indeed. So we're August 6th in the Famicom Disk System. Yeah. We're doing an all-lady protagonist battle royale, even though uh, I don't Earth believe is, it. Earth is stretching it a little bit, but... Uh, and uh, I think she might die in this. Just Gaming's like, uh, most famous dead did. lady. Yeah. yeah. Um, Making your way to the ring. Uh, I think I made the point in an old Games Radar article. Era died in her first game and then appeared in ten more. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Why do they? I'm trying to, who does Aeris. she look like? And she looks. I keep thinking she's Alanis Morissette for some ah. reason. <laughs> <laughs> well, it would be ironic if. Well, she you won. ought to know, Elston. Um, <laughs> <laughs> working on my sports banter here. <laughs> this is a, all off the cuff. Being a healer doesn't really work well in a battle royal, so we'll see. Uh, really happy for the uh, Gotha Origami lady, I can see. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. Laura Croft from the popular Dang Tomb Raider series. Much more fitting wrestling attire, at least. <laughs> Indeed. Yeah. Not so I, I, I chose these entrances for these particular characters, and uh, yeah. I, I like to posit that uh, Laura Croft has bad posture because <laughs> of all that Tomb Raiding and jumping around... <laughs> She uh, she dislocated Ugh. her spine a little bit. Wow. <laughs> and then, yeah, because she likes guns. God, that's great. Uh, uh, that bus size is accurate. Oh, yeah, uh, and also her boots are weighing her down. So done a lot of studying. Got a little bit of a hunch. But who Jeez. knows will come in. This is a six-man lady uh, battle royale, right? Mm -hmm. uh, Over-the-top rope elimination. Yep. Uh, what are they winning this time? Uh, mm -hmm. I guess. Uh, a uh, uh, one get-out-of-gamer game yes. card. <laughs> I have no idea. Um, all, all of their uh, DVR pictures will be erased from the ooh, internet. Ooh, for one day. Then yeah, they'll for, come right yeah. back up, and they'll be as fat and as naked as ever before. Um, the crowd and is... The director fucked up. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Cut the camera, damn it! What is this? Is a uh, lady version of uh, Roman Reigns about to come down? No! Ladies and gentlemen, it is Chell from Portal. Mm -hmm. Portal, which you can only see in the game uh, through the magic yeah. of said portals. And um, only like a very wow. rare opportunities. Whose yeah. entrances? Whose entrance is this? It's a very subtle one. I, you know, she's quiet, so I, I chose right. something right. that never uh, talks. I chose someone who doesn't talk that much because he wasn't that great on the microphone. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, maybe you'll get it when it gets she gets in the ring. So you've modeled these wrestlers after. There we go. And hey, look, hearts, companion cube. Oh, well, that's, oh look at that! Hey, ah, okay, oh, I got it go. now. This is uh, a <laughs> shell model after Bret Hart. <laughs> Uh, the stoic Canadian uh, Indian. That's <laughs> voice associated Bret Hart. <laughs> Seems like the last Indian left alive. Poor modeling on the audience there. Um, but I'm guessing what? Do, are we going to introduce all of them here yeah. and up yeah. the top? She's got no tricks, just fists. Hideo. Yeah, don't pay no attention. Shun Lee, ladies and gentlemen, with the cat oh, ears. Wow. Looks like it was kind of hard to model those thighs uh, looks, along with the hips. Looks like she's uh, in that bonus Dead Rising 3 mode. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Chun Li, ladies and gentlemen. Chun Li, uh, who though she didn't, you know, is not necessarily the star of a Street Fighter game. She did star in her own she movie. She starred in her own movie and does the spinning bird kick, which is oh, hilarious. Oh my god! And I thought it was um, bad when uh, Gal did the flip. Well, we, we were watching a movie recently, and uh, and M Bison from that it movie popped like up. What was it? Was First Contact? That shirt, <laughs> looks like her shirt is made out of like a garbage bag. Star Trek yeah. First Contact. They kill M Bison in it from uh, yeah. Legend of Chun Li. Mm -hmm. The Irish Bison, the one we. Irish <laughs> Bison. <laughs> It's all about the money of Shadaloo. Got my psycho crusher. <laughs> slower, lady, slower. <laughs> is really Hideo's entrance this slow? It is. I mean, oh I haven't god. Seen in a while, so I guess it's been over a year. <laughs> Gelatinous texture of her. <laughs> yeah, oh, god. like what is going on with her it's boobs? Hypnotic. Is it more her boobs or the texture of her outfit? I think it's a combination. Is not helping. So is this the uh, the anime model? Whatever. Because of the boobs. <laughs> Man, I do not remember Hideo doing all this hamming and, and, and so slowly. Oh, wow. The cat here. Lucha <laughs> Dragons. Who is this going to be in our protagonist? Oh, oh, my God. Samus it's Samus Aran. Can, well, can she, that's what her hand on. I don't know who made Celebrating 30 years. And if she gets to the ring fast enough, she has to do it without clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jesus. Yeah, this Samus' is is, suit has never made her jiggle so much. <laughs> uh. Oh, yes. This is... <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Got that, got that screw attack. It's all working out. Uh. <laughs> but yeah, Metroid uh, 30 years ago, first on the Famicom disc ago. system, came to the NES later uh, in the U.S. on a regular cartridge, it becoming one of the first games ever to use passwords mm. because we did not have the disc system in the U.S. No saves for American. Uh, the 
Yes. Uh, pigtails clipping through the tits. Pretty beautiful. And there we go. Faith, yeah. which we just I just learned has a last name Connors. from uh, Connors. Mirror's Edge. Faith Connors. Private eye. <laughs> Faith Connors. <laughs> Connors, I want your badge and gun on my <laughs> desk. You're suspended, Connors. <laughs> Man, with the Randy Orton entrance. <laughs> Faith uh, made her comeback this year in a game that nobody remembers anymore. I forgot I have it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I wanted I have to play it. more of it. Like, mm-hmm. I was vaguely interested, but, man. Not everything needs an open world, Elson. But I, I couldn't Metro- agree more. Metroid, the original Metroid, a game you retroactively do not like I as much. Yeah, as a kid, I was fascinated with it and Me loved too. it and played it a lot and was, you know, 87, 88, kind of there in the beginning. And as the years went on, I was mm-hmm. like, super, me- like, Played Metroid 2, finished that on an actual Game Boy with horrible <laughs> lighting and terrible everything. But Super Metroid and then subsequently things like, especially Zero Mission, just made me go like, I never want to play the original Metroid again. Mm. There's so many little irritating things about it. Um, but it's a very important game and Indeed. was a big deal for me as a kid. And even though I have four Zelda tattoos, <laughs> I was very close to getting Metroid tattoos based a lot off of how impactful that first game was. You still was. can. I'm seeing a lot of bare skin here, Elson. Yeah. You put it anywhere you want. Uh, but the other big thing to note was, yeah, at the time, the manual even in the U.S. referred to Samus as a he mm-hmm. uh, out, of, out of errors. But uh, then when you finish the game, you would see, oh, Samus is a girl. And as a seven-year-old Ooh. boy, that didn't bother me at all. Mm-hmm. It was just, oh, the space person was a girl. Okay. It did, didn't matter. Now, is that canonical with the series is what I'm wondering? Did they actually want Samus to be a girl, or was the the password just something to unlock no, it's not the password. a girl it's version? It's not the password. It's when you beat the game. It's when you beat the game. Yeah. Justin you can, Bailey. You, you can put in the password, Justin Bailey, but it also it is just like you know, it, it set that precedent of if you beat the game quick enough, you will get no helmet and then no suit. Mm. Um, that is, you know, carried over into even the Game Boy one. Little lady with purple hair. I think the one that did it the least is the original <laughs> Metroid Prime. Uh, where all she does is take her helmet off. Look at this. Do we have any favorites here? Um, I mean, out of all these, Samus is still going to be my favorite. Uh, I do like Chell. Um, like Chell, and I just like how Laura Croft has worked her way in as a modern-day gaming icon. Uh, yes. Thankfully, has some uh, good PlayStation games. VR. Is, is she really? Yeah. Oh, with the Rise of the Tomb Raider. Yeah. Also, just like, I don't know who Aerith is based on, but, like, her body proportions are so not what the character is. It's, like, the most off in a, in a funny way. Oh, and it looks like Aerith is about to eliminate Samus immediately, Elson. Please don't cry, uh, uh, even though that will surely she's increase the like. Uh, like, she, it, like if you want Elson to cry. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe if you want her to sob. <laughs> uh, yeah, Samus uh, has no uh, special trick. She got uh, zapped all of her abilities away, and she's just in a regular... Uh, if you look over there in the left hand corner, we have the next gen lady. Uh, once again, <laughs> uh, who's the limit? I missed it. Aerith. Once first again, to die. Once again, uh, she's the first to die. <laughs> first to die. None of these other characters have canonically died, I believe. Uh, Laura Croft was believed dead, <laughs> believe I believe, dead. Uh, in the mid 90s. God, that looks like Alanis Morissette. It can't get really does. Like the other dogma. In dogma, yeah. <laughs> yes. uh. Chun Li, thicker than I'd like, but I'm still a fan. Um. And Faith really taking it to Chell, battling it out over who's going to be everyone's last <laughs> Xbox 360 game. <laughs> oh! Laura jumps in. Uh, um, keep hanging on to Orange Box like I'll ever play it again. Uh, I keep convincing myself I that, will. That game, in retrospect, too good a deal. It is. Better than we deserved. Uh, Jesus. Yeah. I mean, uh, Steam is... Oh, Steam, those games are always cheap on Steam. Just say it. Like, it was a full-price game with all of Half-Life and a surprise portal at Team <laughs> Fortress and some other stuff I can't even remember. Uh, oh my god, oh. Chun-Li has been eliminated. I, I, arguably the most resilient fighter in our lady protagonist roster. Yeah, and also um, the one that, uh, outside of Samus, dates back, oh Jesus. dates back the longest. 91. 91. She's the oldest other than Samus. Yeah. So right now, in order of be, debut, be Samus, Samus, Laura, Chell, and Faith? Chell, yeah. Yes, I believe so. I yes, original, I have to use this voice whenever we're doing yeah. a fantasy fight. I think the original Mirror's Edge is 08. Hmm. Ooh, and I do like uh, Maybe Samus and uh, Faith taking it to one another. Oh. As uh, Faith has never appeared on a Nintendo console. This, ah. I would I would argue that they're meeting for the first time. <laughs> Faith and Chell, right? Yes. Um, yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Anything that's been out after 06 didn't bother going to Nintendo system. <laughs> I could not tell who was going to get the end of that move. Me neither. Color me shocked. Eno- Kick to the nuts to Laura Croft. Let's see how that works. Uh, I imagine you can puncture a vagina. 
And I'm really into the Samus outfit for some reason. Like, it's just the giant Mylar I balloon outfit. I don't yeah. like the bear claw part of it. So yeah, yeah, that's a little silly. But what, <laughs> what it's supposed is to be a blaster, exactly? I think. Yeah, it's supposed <laughs> to be your arm cannon. Yeah, but what is that in the game? What is that supposed to be, David? An oven mitt? I think so. <laughs> like a bear claw? A bear claw, like a donut? <laughs> oh, and Shell taking Faith down. One of the last EA games on Steam, if you can remember that. Uh, EA split off to Origin and no longer offers its games on Steam, but you can constantly find um, the original Mirror's Edge discounted on Steam. It's a good game. It's a fantastic game. Um, one of the best ever, I would say. Like I, I appreciate it more the further we get from it. Um, uh-oh, and Shell is on the outside of the ropes. Is, will she go over, did she go over the ropes? Does that mean an elimination? Yep. Yeah. Uh -oh. Yeah, they can, uh, she can pull. Oh, oh yeah. Faith eliminating uh, Shell. She really should have poured a portal on the ground. It would have uh, saved her butt. <laughs> Just come right out of the center of the ring. A weird time to vamp, Laura. I would really start to pay attention. Uh, Samus Aaron is down, and that is also oh. you, what you could also say about her as a character in the Metroid game. And they're hitting her back, which is going to keep her from being able to do the Morph Ball. <laughs> not sure if we'll ever get another Metroid game. Hopefully she yeah, appears yeah, in Federation got, Force. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, come on, it's next level game. And a suplex from Laura Croft. Samus is hurt, but then... Oh, another! Here we go again! Uh, Russian leg sweep from... Uh, I have no idea. It's a lot of power from a, a lady who's only been in two games. Um, oh. I don't know what kind of move that was. It really looked like it would have hurt Faith more. A lot Here of we them. go. It's going to be in one less game. Because... If Samus has anything to say about it. Come on, Samus. All we right. got to root for Samus. Right, it's your birthday. Oh, and too bad. The, uh -oh. okay. Our AI... Okay. Yes! Samus has eliminated Faith, and this is exactly how I think it would shake out if yeah. you're talking most famous lady protagonist. Yeah. Together the most games between them. Um, yeah. Still got to give it to Samus here. I really want to see some victory poses. Oh, my Larson's. God, no. <laughs> not... Oh, not here the, we go. Not the Cactus Jack Lara Croft. Get her Lara. Lara has Samus on the ropes, but Samus fights back and gets back in. This is not quite over yet. Oh, Gather no, your she's, bearings, Miss Aaron. She's too tired. You can do this. And Laura's knocked down. Oh, she's saluting whoever Free gave the her people. those crappy orders in the other end. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which we did stream a long time ago. One of the first shit shows we ever did oh, in the Laser man, Time other channel. M. Other M. Really, like, I just remember, like, 40 minutes into a cutscene. Move on! Yeah, it's, it's bad. Ooh! It's kind of reversal what here. What is Samus's finisher? Is it a screw attack and they just bounce out of the arena? Could not tell you. I believe it's called the Shadow Complex, ironically. <laughs> um, here we go. Our final moments bum, of our Lady Protagonist bum, Elimination bum, bum, uh, match. Bum, bum, Holy bum. shit! <laughs> yeah, Are cool. we going to see a replay on that? I think we got to. My word. Just let the uh, very a blast in your face. Is that a, uh, we are getting a "This is awesome" chant uh, from, from a PlayStation <laughs> Four. That's hard to do. Need that Super Metroid victory music. Ooh, ooh, almost a success. Here we go. Yes! yes, it has come down to Samus Aran. What a way to celebrate her birthday! They scripted a <laughs> in, scripted a victory yeah. for her. Indeed, that is it. That is a beautiful punch. That's one jump that Lara didn't land. That's that going is strange. She invited everyone to celebrate her birthday party and then won. Beat them up. <laughs> like, how, how fun is that? <laughs> um, but yeah, this match went exactly how I wanted it. Uh, two yeah. favorite lady characters opposing one another. Uh, very happy Though about I, this. I did read on the internet that you can revive Aerith, so uh, hopefully she can get back into this match. <laughs> yeah. and, uh, we'll see. Win. Might have to be for another time. I couldn't be more happy about yeah. this. Well, we'll celebrate it again for Metroid's <laughs> 60th birthday. That's right. Just come back to this channel and watch this video again. Yeah. <laughs> It'll make us re-promote it. Uh, but this has been a uh, another episode of Laser Times Fantasy Fights. You can subscribe to the channel, and you can watch even more uh, featuring things like Pokemans and Ninja Turtles. Oh, yeah. Uh, we love you guys. Uh, subscribe to the channel, please, and listen to Laser Time, and go to lasertimepodcast.com. We love you, people. Good, good night. <laughs>